This is an original recipe made about 25 years ago. This right here is definitely one of the major uniqueness of it. But then you start to get that heat with it. Hey guys, it's Bill Vinci from the Empire Plate. Well, actually, it's Empire Unique Eats. Today, we're in West Philly, New York. We're going to a place called Knuckleheads Brew House. We are doing our Empire Unique Eats most unique wing sauce here in central New York. We're inside, we're gonna go talk to Mike and see what he's got planned for us. Come on, let's go. Okay, we're at Knuckleheads. I'm with Mike DeSantis. Mike, how you doing, buddy? Great, Billy. Really always great. good to see you, man. You too. This is what, like your third time on our show? Yes. Jeez, yes. we yeah. always got you on. Right. You must love the camera. <laughs> love you, Billy. <laughs> We're checking out five of the most unique wing sauces in central New York. And today, what do you guys got going on here? What kind of wing sauce? We're gonna we're gonna serve you our uh, whatever wing sauce. Okay. And this is an original recipe made about 25 years ago from the original owners. And uh, wow. we're proud to serve this to this day. And uh, it's it's a real hit here. This is this is like a local favorite. Everybody wow. comes in and they want the whatever wing. So can you tell us a little bit what's in it? But maybe not everything, but... If I told you, I'd have to kill you. You know what? That's the second time he told me that. Last time we filmed here, you were making something in the back, and I tried to have the camera sneak around the catcher. Right. Remember that? Yeah, and yeah, you blocked yeah. it. You, you came after me. That's right. So we're not going to be able to get to That's find right. out what's in the wing sauce. But we're going to see the guys make them in the back. We're going to get to try them. Unless Mike gets in front of me, he'll just kind of bulldoze me over and get the hell out of my way. All right, Mike. Thanks for having us here, man. Thanks, Billy. So we got our uh, whatever wings here at Knuckleheads. They smell incredible. I kind of wish you guys could get, you know, I wish we had something on the camera where you could get the smell effect to it because they just smell incredible. I can tell they're extremely crispy, but the sauce, man, let's see. Let's see how these taste. Wow, cooked perfect, extremely crispy. The sauce has got great flavor to it. Um, no bite to it, not hot. It's a very smooth sauce with a ton of flavor. Okay, so we just finished up a show here at Knuckleheads in Westmoreland. Mike, I want to thank you, man, so much for having us come back. Always good to see you. You too, Billy. Thank you so much. The wings were incredible. That sauce was absolutely killer. But I do got to ask you something. Can I get some of that sauce to come home? I mean, can people get that sauce? Absolutely. People, people come all the time. They order it by the quart. I think it's like $14 a quart. But okay. yeah, anytime you want it, we have it. Yeah. There it is. Come down to Knuckleheads. Try the whatever wing. So this was stop one on our Empire Unique Eats wing sauce. We are headed to stop number two now. Okay, I'm hanging out with Brady and Colby. How are you guys yeah, doing today? Good, good. How about you? Good. We're good. back at Fratello's, uh, part of our Empire Unique Eats uh, special, and this is wing sauce. And yeah. you guys got a sauce here that's pretty interesting. Yeah. Well, the thing is, he brought it to our attention. He's been collaborating. We've had the pizzeria 13 years. So right. As kids, we would just mess around, put crazy sauces together, sandwiches, things like that. He came to me with this this base of a sauce that was just it hit perfectly. It's a little sweet. It's got a little tang. It's got that little bit of bite. Mm -hmm. And we worked on it for what, like two and a half months, three months? Just little tweaks. Little, little tweaks. tweaks. Um, I actually started it, um, I was like maybe 11 or 12. I was still in middle school. Wow. And um, I made six sauces one night. And there, five of them were absolutely <laughs> terrible. Um, originally, it was actually going to be a dipping sauce for like pizza and stuff. Yeah. I was like, you know what? What goes well with pizza? And I was like, wow, this actually tastes really good. Let's try it on, let's say, chicken or anything like that. Right. And then I tried chicken wings. And I was like, wow, this is really good. You know, the, there's some unique things that are around here that you're going to see today, I'm sure, sure. in other places. Yeah. Like yep. the and jelly wings that one last yep. year. Yep. So we're, we're exactly. kind of like, all right. I but, know. But this this one is, it's not just for wings. That, I think that's what makes it special. Right. It's you an can any put sauce. Anything. That's kind of what we're calling sure. it. I've seen people put on their salads and their pizza, on yeah. pizza, yeah. Yeah. On, on wings. And yeah. Exactly. But it's got that balance of that crispy of that, that real chicken, because we do fresh chicken wings, right? You know, yep. no, no pre bake. So right. it just has that perfect balance. All right. So we're in the kitchen. We're getting ready to make uh, this wing sauce. 
So uh, start us off, Colby, what yeah, do you got? Absolutely, so we got a cayenne red sauce here. Secret sauce here, I'm sure a lot of the locals know, but don't want to claim it out. Homemade white dressings. 85% of this mixture is homemade in-house. Okay. And that, that's a lot of, especially all this stuff too. Right. That, that really right. is what you know me and Brady worked on to get that, that special flavor in there. Okay. Because the original one was much simpler. Yeah. You know, I was 11. Right, right. <laughs> now you just include a lot, of, a lot of extra stuff in it. Stuff that funny. brought it to another level. And this that's one funny. obviously being Himalayan BC, or the yeah. Brady Colby sauce, this right here is definitely one of the major uniqueness of it. So it's Himalayan salt. A little bit of salt and pepper blend. I just wanted to get those going. Before it's completely put together, we have a nice little secret blend of fresh garlic and other spices. And this is where that marination period of at least a day comes in. We in the cooler, we let it sit and soak in. Uh -huh. It gets all that rich flavor of the fresh herbs. Yep. You can see that that coloring. Oh, yeah, 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 definitely. You can see the change. Well, yeah, that, that's the there it is. Now. There's the sauce. Next, we're gonna dump the wings and the oil, get them nice and crispy, and then that sauce is going on top. Yeah. Okay, so we got the wings brought out, the Himalaya BC wings, and like I told you before, look at the sauce with this. It's not overloaded sauce, you don't see it, but they stay on the wing perfect. Look at that. Let's see how these babies taste. Man, I gotta tell you, we had these on the last show, but now I'm actually getting the full, I'm coming fresh out of the, the fryer. This sauce is absolutely delicious. It's insane. Like you said, it's got you can taste the different spices in it. Mm -hmm. Just the mixture of everything you guys combine into it yeah. just comes all together it perfect. Takes on a, it takes on a trip. It, it, it's, it's so sweet good. And spicy and then perfectly heated, but never too. You're not sweating. Yeah. Not not a sweat. Well, I wouldn't say that. <laughs> you know what? I think I'm gonna let these guys hang around Brady and Colby and uh, join us for lunch today. So I'm gonna enjoy the wings. Come down to Fratello's, try these Himalaya BC wings out. They're insane. Okay, so we just finished episode two of Empire Unique Eats Wing Sauce here at Fratello's in Frankfurt. Guys, I want to thank you so much for having us oh, here, thank man. You. Thank you. This sauce was absolutely insane. You guys came up with a great creation. Make sure you check it out. Come down to Fratello's. Try this wing sauce out, man. It's absolutely insane. <laughs> so, we're off to stop number three on our journey here. So, we'll see you guys soon. Hey guys, it's Phil Vinci from Empire Unique Eats. We're up in Poland, New York. We're at Enzo's Pizzeria. This is our third stop on our journey looking for the most unique wing sauces. So, why don't we go inside and meet Nick at his new place and see what he's got planned for us. So we're at Enzo's Pizza in Poland. I'm with Nick. Hey, good to see you again, man. See you again, man. Seems like this is a regular thing uh, lately. Yeah, We've yeah. Been hanging out with you quite a bit. Well, new place here in Poland. Yep, yep. Just opened up, so you got a lot going on here. But we're here for this wing sauce. Now, you got a lot of different wing sauces. I do. We actually have 15 different wing sauces. So we pride ourselves on giving everybody a flavor that they want. You know? Okay. A choice. Yeah, exactly. That's a that's a good amount. So yep. what are you making today? What is the wing sauce you got? So I was trying to think of something that is unique to us and us only. Um, so I was going through all my sauces and I decided to do a, a creamy mango habanero sauce. Oh wow, that's that mango I really get at the end. And the yeah, that, comes now, after. Start, now it's starting to hit my tongue, so I'm getting a little heat. Yeah. That's good. Wow, that's different. Ooh, okay. Yeah. So, got a nice bite to it? Okay. It does, it does. So, it's got a mixture of uh, a couple things that we have back there. Uh, there's a little bit of ranch dressing in it, which gives you that cool bite. Yep. On top of the spicy from the habanero. Okay. And then the mango brings in a little sweet flavor. Oh, so, like you got that. sweet, cool, and spicy mm -hmm. all in one. And then we get the trying, which I can't wait. Yeah. We're looking make, forward to it. And make sure you guys come up and check them out in Poland. Springtime, you can be open up the dining yeah, area. Yeah, so right now we're dining, uh, takeout and delivery only. Okay. The dining room is hoping to open sometime this spring, hopefully March, April. Okay. Um, 
we will be updating our Facebook page as more starts to transpire. But right now, we're doing takeout and delivery, which is good because up in the north area, not many places to deliver. So we try to get the food out to as many people as possible. All right, so make sure you hit up Enzo's in Poland. Now it's time to go see Nick put these wings together. Let's Thanks, go, Thank you. Awesome. All right, so we just got our wings brought out. These are the creamy mango habanero wings. And I gotta tell you something. You guys can smell this through the camera. You, you, you can smell that mango, which, which I absolutely love. Again, with this sauce, it sticks to the wing perfectly. It stays with it, it doesn't trip off. Wow, you know what, that first bite, like I said earlier, you taste that mango is the first initial bite but then you start to get that heat with it, and you start to feel it down your tongue, and it is just perfect amount of spice, along with the ranch. Here we are, Enzo's in Poland. Make sure you check these wings out. They're fantastic. All right, so we just finished up our third segment of Empire Unique Eats here in Poland at Enzo's. Nick, I want to thank you, man, for another coming up. Really awesome time, man. Incredible wings. These are going to be featured on our show, and you got to get up to try them. But me and Nick were talking a little bit about something different, which I thought was actually as unique as the wing sauce about what you do for to go wings. Talk a little bit so, about that. Because we only had takeout and delivery, unfortunately, when you put chicken wings in the container to go, a lot of times they get soggy and right. people like crispy wings, right? Right. So, my suggestion to customers is if you want a true crispy wing, is to get the wings dry with the wing sauce on the side. I uh, can't wait for that. So, I am off to our next stop. It'll be stop number four on our journey, finding the most unique wing sauce in Central New York. We'll see you guys soon. Okay, we are back at City Cafe. I'm with Steve again. We this guy looks familiar. He was on our unique taco episode, which was awesome. You had the Utica Devil taco which was incredible, very spicy, but today a little different. Now we're doing a unique wing sauce. So what are you making for us today? All right, so today we're making what we're calling a Seattle wing. Okay. Um, they're made with brown sugar, coffee, and then our salsa is with espresso and cocoa powder. Wait a minute, so a coffee like, wait a minute. Coffee dry rub. Coffee dry rub? Yep. No way, yep. okay. And, and what else is in it? You said there's a and cocoa, brown sugar, brown sugar in the rub, and then in the sauce there's cocoa powder and espresso powder. Knew it. Yeah, it's known for their coffee. Yes. All right. So we're gonna see you put these together. I can't wait to try. I've never seen anything like it. Like this kind of blowing my mind when you told me a little bit about this. What's in it? So this can be different. Oh yeah. All right. Let's see Steve put these things together. Okay, so we just got uh, our wings out. These are the Seattle wings, a kind of coffee-based texture, flavor, just something crazy that I'd never heard of or even seen. So, look at that. Let's yeah. try these. Now, I gotta tell you, the color, I love it being charred rub. One of my favorite ways to eat wings, but I gotta try it plain because I wanna actually get the taste, but blue cheese looks amazing too, so let's see how these babies taste. Wow, I really taste that coffee texture in it. Um, now I'm starting to get the cocoa taste to it. Are you getting? Are you getting that yeah, same yeah. vibe? Yeah, the sweetness. It's almost the cocoa is making like a nice syrupy glaze to it. That coffee-based flavor is out of this world. I really, really like it. I love the charred grill taste of it. To try to explain it, I'm probably not doing a great job because I don't think I've ever had anything like it. It's absolutely delicious, so I absolutely love it. So, here it is, the unique wing, the Seattle wing, at City Cafe in Whitesboro. I don't think anybody's gonna figure out what's in those wings until we tell them after, but thought they were pretty good though? Yeah, they're really good. Think of the wing overall. Oh, good, fantastic, I would order them. Yeah. They were terrific. They were terrific. Yeah. All right, so we just finished up another episode of Empire Unique Eats, Unique Wing Sauces today. 
I gotta say, man, this was pretty insane. Something I can't even I can't even describe like I had trouble with it earlier. I can't wait for people to come and try this out. Yeah, I know. I'm excited. You should try it out. You know, it's sweet and savory. All right, Seattle Wings City Cafe. We'll see you guys in the next episode.